Today on our 2006 Toyota Prius, we will be test fitting the Inno Fork Lock 3 roof mounted bike rack. That's part number INA391. So our Prius here already has its roof rack system already installed. We can go ahead and begin by setting our bike rack up on top of our, our roof rack here. So what you want to make sure, is so we'll go ahead and unlock the top portion of our bike rack here. We'll undo our lever and then we'll slide out our bolt that holds our clamp up. So I'm going to lift that out of the way and just put that just like that. And then I'm going to go ahead and get the rear one in position. I'm just going to slide it back a little bit further. Slide the bolt up as well as the rear clamp. I'll loosen that up a little bit so we can get that where it needs to be. Just about got it. All right, so you want it about that position. We'll make sure the bike rack is straight. Before we tighten those down, we'll go ahead and tighten up the front first. So we'll bring our bolt down of our lever like this. Make sure it's all the way down and you can adjust it. You can fine tune the adjustment here if you'd like with this little nut on the end. But what we want to do is we to push up on the clamp underneath just a little bit and slide that underneath. Send up a tad more here. There we go. Go like that. All right. What we want to do is we want to be able to close our lever just like that so it provides a nice tight fit around our crossbar. So we're going to leave this open because we need this open in order to attach our bike to our skewer. So we want to open up our skewer making sure that's loosened up enough on both sides to where our fork can fit in. So that looks pretty good for now. Let's go ahead and tighten up our rear clamp and then we can grab our bike. We'll undo our strap. So we'll grab our bike, and set our fork in, make sure that our rear strap goes between our spokes. We'll get our fork first. We want to be able to close our lever up and provide a nice snug fit. So it's still a little loose. Uh, just about got it. So we want to be able to close that skewer up just so it sits above the front portion of our bike rack here. That way we can still close our top cap and lock it up. And with it locked, nobody can get into our skewer and remove our bike. All right, with that being done, we can go ahead and do our rear wheel strap. Like I said, we'll make sure it goes between our spokes. It's got a ratcheting system on both sides. So we'll just pull that down, make sure it's nice and tight and ready to go. That's going to complete our test fit of the NL Fork Lock 3 roof mounted bike rack, part number INA391 on our 2006 Toyota Prius. Let's see how that performed on our test course. This is our test course. Let's start with the slalom. This shows side to side action such as turning corners or evasive maneuvering. Then on to our alternating speed bumps. This shows twisting action, such as hitting curbs, potholes, road debris, or uneven pavement. And last of all, the solid speed bumps. This shows up and down action, such as driving through a parking lot or parking garage, or driving in and out of a driveway.